having such a major multi-day sporting event really is a win for Kansas City. And the city has a secret weapon of sorts. Here to explain our secret weapon, KSHB 41 anchor Brian Magic. Brian, bring us up to speed on this secret weapon. Well, thank you for the vote of confidence, Kevin. I really appreciate it. Yeah, that secret weapon actually runs on wheels, uh, rails, actually. We're here at Union Station. It's called the streetcar. Here at Union Station, this is the end of the stop, but there's work underway right now to extend it farther up Main Street. And it's something like this, a transportation project that is a big deal for Kansas City. It helps to attract new events to our area and keep others from leaving, like the Big 12. From Union Station... The River Market. People who live around here know the streetcar is a great option to get around. Now visitors are finding out too. It's pretty exciting. It's, it's a pretty convenient thing. Brett Faberg is from Iowa. He and his wife are in town for the Big 12. So is Debbie Wright from Texas. Super friendly, easy to get around. Hours are great. Great reviews from out of towners and great news to people like Kathy Nelson. I have goosebumps when I think about our competition. Those are good goosebumps. You see, Kathy is with the Kansas City Sports Commission. Her job is to attract and keep sports events in Kansas City. They use the streetcar as a marketing tool. When we had the NFL draft here for a site visit before we were selected, um, we came to Union Station, we put them on a streetcar, we brought them back to Power and Light District just to show the ease of how simple it is in our city to get to and from these areas and how quick it is. The line stops at Union Station, but now work is underway for an expansion down Main Street to UMKC. Completion is expected in 2025. Donna Mandelbaum is with Casey Streetcar. For our visitors that come in for Big 12 tournaments or other events, that expands their option on where they can go and explore Kansas City, and they could do it all for free. Magic words that help Casey stand out in a competitive market. We know we're a force, and it's because of things like the streetcar and also our relationships with people like Union Station, Power and Light District, and all the great venues we have. We certainly stand out because of these things. Now, I am told that when it comes to ridership on the streetcar that it actually dipped because of COVID, but those numbers are now climbing, and I am told they're expected to triple by 2025 when the streetcar expansion project is finished. And it's transportation projects like this that are good news for all the people who are trying to sell Kansas City to the country and the world. Reporting live in Kansas City, Missouri tonight outside of Union Station, I'm Brian Metric, KSHB 41 News.